Hello everyone, I'm Esther from Manage Engine and in this video we are going to be discussing NanoCore. The NanoCore Remote Access Trojan was first discovered back in 2013 when it was being sold in underground forums. The malware has variety of functions which includes Keylogger as well which is a password stealer that can remotely pass along data to the malware operator. It also has the ability to tamper and view footage from webcams, screen locking, downloading and theft of files and much more. The current nano core remote access trojan is now being spread through Malspain campaigns which utilizes social engineering techniques in which the email contains fake ba bank payment receipt and request for quotation as well. The emails also contain malicious attachments with .img or .iso extension and another version of NanoCore is also distributed in phishing campaigns leveraging specially crafted zip file which is designed to bypass secure email gateways. The malicious zip file can be extracted by certain versions of Power Archiver, WinRAR and our older 7-zip. The stolen information is then sent to the command and control servers of the malware attacker itself. This RAT then gathers data such as browsers, usernames and passwords, FTP which is file transfer protocol clients, email credentials of popular mail clients and sends all of this information to its servers. Through this cyber attack, the malware's use is able to compromise system security and also violate user privacy. So how can this be prevented? By using a SIM solution that's mapped to the MITRE attack matrix, you'll be alerted to phishing attempts in your network in real time, malicious file execution, keylogger techniques that help collect user information and also data exfiltration attempts as well. Therefore, stopping a cyber attack that uses trojans like nanocore. Thank you.